there! In this video, we are going to show you how to move your Quicken data file from one computer to another using an external drive. You might need to move your Quicken data file if you've purchased a new computer or simply want to have your file on another computer. Before we begin, there are a few things to understand before you move your data file. You don't need to buy another copy of Quicken to move your data file from one computer to another. But the same version of Quicken should be installed on the computer you're moving your data file to. Subscription users can access Quicken on the web on any computer to review accounts without needing to install Quicken on an additional computer. And finally, you should never open or run Quicken on a network or share your data file between two computers at the same time. Now that we've gone over those important details, let's start the process of moving your data file to another computer. First, you'll need to install Quicken on your new computer and ensure it's on the latest release. You can check the release by opening Quicken and selecting Help and then About Quicken. Then, you'll need to ensure that you have your external drive inserted into your old computer. Now it's time to put a copy of your Quicken data file on your external drive. You'll start the process on your old computer. First, you'll need to make sure that Quicken is open, and then you'll select File, Backup and Restore, Backup Quicken File. In the Quicken Backup window, you'll see the current data file name, the backup file name, and the option to add the date to the backup file name. This Change button is where you can select your external drive as the location you'd like to save your backup to. Once selected, you'll be presented with a File Explorer window. On the left-hand side, you'll find the locations in which you can select to store your data file. We're going to select the USB drive and then click Save. Now that we selected our location, it's time to back up our file. You're going to click Back Up Now to complete the process. You can now close Quicken and safely eject your external drive from your old computer. Now it's time to restore your data file on your new computer. You'll need to start by inserting your external drive into your new computer. Once you've inserted your external drive, you'll need to open your File Explorer to be able to move that file from your drive to your desktop. If you are using Windows 10, you can open your File Explorer by selecting the File Folder icon on your Start Menu taskbar, or you can right-click on the Start Menu and then select File Explorer. In your File Explorer, you'll select your external drive. Next, you'll drag your Quicken file from the external drive to your computer's desktop. Now you can see your file has successfully been moved and is safely on your desktop. Now it's time to open your data file in Quicken. You'll need to begin by opening Quicken and you can do so by double clicking on the Quicken icon. The first time you open Quicken on your new computer, you'll be prompted to select your existing data file to get started. Since we've moved the file from your external drive to your desktop, we'll want to ensure the Open a Data File located on this computer option is selected, and then we'll click Get Started. A File Explorer window will appear, and you'll need to locate and select your data file. Then, click Open. Finally, you'll need to tell Quicken the location where you'd like to restore your backup file to. You can do so by clicking the Browse button and selecting the location on the left-hand side. For this example, we're going to keep our file on the desktop, so we'll want to select Desktop and then click Save. Now, you're ready to click Restore Backup. You are back into your original file and can complete any necessary updates. Thanks for watching!